what's up people this is Nami from War with Peace channel today we're gonna explore some of the solutions for the errors that are occurring in our Android studio um, here the main problem we are facing is uh, uh, the virtual device um, here right now when it starts to run this uh, this error pops up so uh, there are uh, there are a few solutions that we can solve this so today we're gonna see that the first solution is that it is asking us to install Hexam Intel CPU acceleration technology. So um, in this, uh, uh, when it comes to Android Studio, everything that matters is the the software development kit packages. So, so what are the things that you want to install, and what are the things that you don't want to install? So all the th all those things can be um, just installed right here. So when you uh, check on this and if you want to install 5.0 lollipop version you can just uh, check on that option and then you can click apply it will install so right now I have uh, just installed the Android 5.0 lollipop but the matter is it is asking us to install this particular package so what you need to do is uh, you just uh, uh, make a check uh, on it on this option and then click apply and the following uh, component will be installed uh, it will uh, installed in uh, within uh, no matter time uh, yeah uh, right now it is uh, installed see good so uh, what do you have is uh, now uh, we're going back and then uh, we are trying to run this thing but still it shows error because I do not have the the Intel component uh, which supports this uh, Hexam uh, uh, CPU acceleration because my processor does not support uh, this Intel virtualization technology so the first thing you need to do is you have to check this whether you have this option which says yes or not so right now I don't have this uh, facility on my uh, CPU motherboard so uh, the problem is the people who do not have this uh, uh, feature on your motherboard it says no for those people it will show this error even after you install that Intel um, Hexam technology so uh, the second solution for the people who doesn't have this visualization technology in your motherboard it's pretty simple and uh, by the way I will put this uh, software uh, download link in the description so that you can download and check it by yourself whether you have this virtualization technology saying yes or no so right now I'm gonna so uh, I'm gonna show an another solution for the people who it says like you don't uh, have the uh, feature of uh, running virtualization technology uh, the simple thing is we need to change it into RM ARM technology so this option is enabled for me because so um, when I changed it when I changed it into uh, our ARM uh, CPU technology then um, my processor can able to run it but uh, it's not going to be that much faster than uh, that uh, Intel CPU acceleration but uh, this is another solution I found out uh, in case still the error is on I'm just gonna run it right now and then it will successfully run so the reason because uh, behind this is uh, we need to install a package called ARM uh, packages uh, from uh, SDK manager <coughs> I will show you that uh, right now good uh, so successfully we have uh, launched the AVD but um, uh, what made it to run the main thing here we need is the in uh, the SDK tools just click on this launch standalone SDK manager uh, it will show the detail the packages of what all things that are installed in our uh, which uh, Android studio and uh, what are uh, not installed yeah so uh, the thing you need to worry about uh, right here is uh, this section Android 5.1.1 uh, which 
I have uh, installed uh, the only uh, API version so in here you just check on this uh, checkbox and then all these uh, available plugins are checked in the main things that you need to install here is uh, Android TV ARM and then ARM EAPI all this ARM uh, plugins or packages whatever the things they are you need to check on this so by this case uh, I just giving all these options checked because we still have this Intel Atom system image which might be boosts up a little bit uh, to run this AVD so I suggest you people to just check on this so that all the packages might get installed see right now I have all the packages installed except the few which I thought that it's not necessary uh, actually it's not that much necessary when it compares to all other things so I suggest uh, you do all these things and then click on this install packages so that it will take a little amount of time but uh, by the time you complete the installation process all those things you can successfully run uh, this AVD in your uh, system but it's a kind of a little bit a slow process uh, um, in case you want a better one you need to upgrade your processor as well as motherboard uh, into a, a more far more better a faster processor so that uh, you can uh, run these things uh, the thing which I have shown in the first place that uh, internal CPU acceleration through visualization technology so these are the two uh, solutions that you can now uh, find out in uh, Android studio the errors that are popping out so uh, you can uh, find this uh, hopefully a uh, useful one and if you do don't forget to hit that like button in my video and if you have any other doubts on this video or you are facing any other errors please do comment on me this video so that um, I can reply so thanks for watching this video until then see you next time